Layers. Oh, looks like we got ourselves a fight here. A troll cave. What is in a troll cave? Ah! Hey, you guys, are you ready for adventure? Oh, wow, it's actually really, really bright. Didn't realize that right. Okay, here we go. Are you guys ready for it? Hey, look at look into the screen character. There we go. look. Are you? I guess he's not ready. I guess he's not ready. It's your host, Get Good Fox, and I'm back in Valheim. I've organized our inventory and stuff like that, and. Uh, what we need to do now is uh, we are going to be looking for more Sertling cores. That is uh, that is as far as I got in the game, basically, and uh, that's what we need to do. So I don't know. I'm just going to pick a direction, and we're just going to go in that direction because right now I kind of feel like any direction is as good as any direction right now. There's no, I don't think there's any one particular better direction to go. I tried to go to sleep to get more daytime, but they were like, oh, you can't sleep at this hour. So I'm like, you know what? That's fine. We'll just head on out. Oh. And I'm going to be bringing the basher with me. And that's because, one, you know, get some blunt EXP. But also, uh, there is a... I'm pretty sure that there is a weapon element system. And I'm pretty sure if we're going to be fighting a lot of, like... Um, skeletons, I believe they are vulnerable to crush damage. So the crush damage should come in a lot of handy. Anyways, let's see if we can get ourselves to the Black Forest. Okay, I don't know if this is the Black Forest, but I, oh yeah, it is. So I have reached an area we haven't explored, so I'm just going to kind of go into this area that has been unrevealed. And we're just going to get started. What is this? Is this anything interesting? I don't know. It's just a, a land formation. So, yeah, we can't really get anywhere until we get more circling cores. That's, we're basically stuck. We are stuck like Chuck until that happens. So, uh, how do we find circling? Well, we got to find um, layers. Oh, looks like we got ourselves a fight here. Here we go. Oh, wait. Maybe I can... Big brain. Not big brain, they saw me. Let me get around them. That's right, you can't handle the damage. Take them out. You weaklings. I've destroyed your like support guy. And now you're next. Both of you, I stab you both at the same time. Oh, that's right. I parried his rock, and it just startled him that much. He was like, good gravy, he's the chosen one. He parried my rock. Oh, they left a treasure chest here. What is this? Flinthead arrows? Ah, I added to my stock. And some extra feathers means I can make some more. Oh, looks like he's come to avenge his comrades. Let's see how that goes for you. Didn't go too well. All right, so... We need to find, now I don't know where they are. I just know they're somewhere in this forest. But if you want me to tell you where they are exactly, well, I'm afraid that is, you are gonna be SOL there. And I also just don't know this area very well in general. Like, I have never really just gone that deep into the, the forest. So I'm just gonna pick a direction and we're just gonna go. Let's see what you got. Let me see how this weapon works. Definitely not quite as good, but we're mainly bringing it for the skeletons. Oh god. We gotta find crypts. That's what we're looking for. We gotta find a crypt. What is this thing? It's glowing. Thistle? I mean, I'll pick it up. Sure. Doesn't look like it unlocked any recipes for me, but... I don't know, it's different. Oh, here's a blueberry. I've gotten one of these before. There we go. Obviously you can eat them. Probably could use them for better crafting recipes too. I think the snow leads to the mountain. That's not where we're trying to go. So let's, like I said, we're just picking a direction and we're just going. I have no idea where we're going, but I'm just picking a direction and, oh, those look like mushrooms. I mean, we do need to, we need a little bit of resources here and there. Might as well grab them as I go. But the main thing we need, we need a lot of Sertling cores. We need about 10 of them. And if we don't get the Sertling cores, well then, 
I'm afraid we won't be able to do anything in terms of, like, metal forging. Because we won't, you know, like, basically, I didn't even bring my pick with me. Oh! I think we got one right here, boys. This looks promising. Nice. Let me label this one. Um, I don't know. Dungeon, I guess? Dungeon. There we go. All right, we're going in. I sure hope it's a dungeon. A troll cave. What is in a troll cave? I'm I'm leaving. I am leaving. No. I'm leaving. I thought that was like a good place. But it's not. It's a terrible place. You tricked me. Let me try the axe on. Maybe because they're like tree people, maybe the axe is the answer. No, the spear seems to do the best against those guys. Okay. Um, we need to change this annotation into troll cave. I mean, maybe that'll be a good idea at a later point in time. I feel like I wouldn't want to fight a troll in close combat. I mean... Oh, here we go. We can bash these guys down. Here we go. That's right. My shield is too much for you. Oh, yeah. That's not bad. Not bad. I mean, it's not a certling core, but it's not bad. And it looks like this is bro... Well, I don't know why I went up there. I wasn't even a thing up here. Okay, um, I don't know. Let's just pick a direction I haven't gone. Let's go past the cave, and we'll just keep adventuring and keep trying to find something. Yeah, I'm looking for formations like these, though. Like, you know, this looks like a kind of, like, doesn't look like a completely natural formation. That's kind of the hint that there is a crypt or nearby or something like that. I don't know where they are, though. Like I said, this is the part of the game that's, like, a bit uncharted. Not a bit, a very uncharted for me. I've never really explored the, um... The Black Forest. You know, I've only poked around in it. This is the first time that I'm just like, I'm just going in. Here, give me my shield. Which one of you wishes to face me? Oh, one more. There we go. Oh, my God. Now that I have my... You, you can see now that I have my... Oh, I believe this is tin. Yeah, that's tin. I didn't bring my pick with me, but that's fine, because I don't even want to get any of this until we actually get the Sertling cores, like, one thing at a time. Because gathering a... It, it takes a little while to do. The, uh, the pick, you know, the pick process of the excavating the minerals, it's not a fast process. Maybe if you get a better pick, that'll be different, but, like, I'm talking about, like, right, just like right now, it's not a fast process. Was that a stone? I've never I haven't read the stones inside the forest. Maybe I'll get some interesting information. Rune stone. Oh god, it's long. Let all who read me beware of the gray dwarfs, the skulkers in darkness, the soulless ones. They are born of from rotten rainfall. They spring like mushrooms from the smoking soil. There is nothing on their tongues or behind their eyes. Those who fear nothing should still fear them. When the soul of a murderer or a great sinner rots under the ground, it makes into a hollow cyst which draws rock and wood and moss to it. It gathers up the peat into flesh, braids reed into bone, and takes rags for skin. It should not walk, but when the night comes, it walks. Should you read this, see, should you who read this see one with a sword in your hand, lance it and let it out, or put it to the, for, to the torch, for it fears the flame. Interesting. Looks like, uh, maybe I'll try burning them with a torch. Interesting idea. Looks like we are about to hit nightfall, unfortunately. That's why I wanted to sleep before then, but whatever. It just means, I mean, it means it's going to be harder to find. I mean, I could try and chop down and just make like a makeshift bed or something like that. Where are we going? This area is crazy. It's like so steep. I don't even know where I'm going. 
Like, I have a strong feeling that there's not going to be anything in the way of, um, crypts down. I mean, I guess I found the, the troll, the troll cave, so, I mean, it's not entirely true, but still. Oh, we can, oh, it's a deer. I don't think I could, I might get it. I'm heading him off. Nope. No, oh, stamina. Oh, wait, I can throw the spear. Taking a random shot. Nope, I don't have the stamina to keep up. Give me a little bit left. The random throw! Oh, I oh I think I hit the tree. I didn't hit the deer. Oh, you went into the water? You idiot! Get me, get me my bow. There we go. Nice. Okay, because we still need we still need like deer hides and stuff like that. That's still something that I'm looking for. Okay, so it is officially, like, cold and stuff, so I think I'm actually going to head back to the base so that we can skip to the daytime. Because, like I said, it's just going to be a pain. It's going to be, like, hard to load. You know, we're actually searching for something relevant, and I think that's just going to be really hard if we don't, you know, if we don't have daylight. Oh my god, we found the troll. I'm going to try and take him out. Like, I, I'm told that he can be taken out, so, like, I don't know. I'm going to give it a try. Let's see how much damage we actually do to him. Oh, that's doable. Oh, he doesn't have as much health as I thought. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's really big, though. Come on. Here we go. His face is really funny looking. Okay, it looks like he has way more health than I thought, but he's got, like, it was the sneak attack that did the damage. Ho, ho. You, you might catch, well, he might actually catch me. Ooh, oh my face! My f oh, my face! Face! I gotta make sure I don't completely run out of stamina. Ah! Mmm, lots of withdrawing needed. I need stamina. We shouldn't be fighting him at night when I'm cold. And we're fighting him on the worst terrain. This is the worst place to fight him. Am I being attacked by what I think I am? Yes, I am. The worst terrain for a fight. I'm pretty sure Sun Tzu wrote something about this. Not fighting on, like, really bad terrain. Oh, What are all these deer doing here? Why is everything here when I don't want to fight here? I mean, let me just take what I can get, I guess. You wouldn't... Okay, good. It, it, it's fine. I hope I can actually find the stuff! Okay, give me my stuff. Here we go. Give me my stuff. Where did all my stuff go? Okay, I see more shining stuff over there. Gimme. Over here. Gimme. Over here. Up the thing. Oh, we're also using the Ekthir's ultimate power, which is allowing me to regain my stamina quicker. It either gives me more stamina or it like reduces my stamina consumption, one of the two. Either way, we're using it because, like, I, I kind of need it right now. Okay, hold on a second. I need to, like, get my stick. Here we go. Yeah, remember the rules for these hills. Like, I have to sprint in order to go up them. If I'm not sprinting, then I'll slide back down. I'm so here. Going up, going up. Oh, made it. All right, let's see if we can find that troll again. I wonder if it's health regenerated. I'm sure we'll find out when we find it. There it is. Are you ready for this? No, you weren't. All right, let's go sneak up on this troll and see if... Let's see if its health has come back or not. It hasn't. That means we can use hit and run attacks on it. 
Your time has come! Oh, didn't do as much. Oh god, he might do like, hit once on me. Let me bait an attack off! I got, are you gonna come down here? Aha! Uh -huh. You don't like this terrain, I do the oh, headshots for more damage? Oh ho, right in your nose! Oh ho, right in your like, lip! Oh ho, right in your like, eyebrow! Oh, he doesn't like it. Oh my god, look at his butt. Okay, hold on a second. <laughs> Get up! <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. Oh no, I need a little more stamina to get up. Okay. Let me get my stamina. We, we've almost got him, boys. Just gotta get my stamina back and then they'll be doomed. One, two, three. Uh, uh, we're up. Where did he go? It's gonna be the big ambush, boys. Let me Let me eat some more food. Here we go. Big ambush time. Oh, I, sh I should have just kept shooting. What am I doing? Keep shooting. Oh, what am I doing? I'm an idiot! Down he go! Oh, literally. Hey, it looks like he's just going to... What did he drop? Uh oh. I, I'm encumbered. We can't pick any of this up, which... Why is there a big face there? Oh, it's a trophy. Um, okay, we gotta drop something. I mean, we, we got plenty of these. Okay, let me get all these troll hides. Yeah, give me the troll hides. No room? Oh, I know why. Um, we gotta drop something. Um, whatever. I got plenty of this. Drop. Here we go. Oh, that's money. Troll hide, troll leather tunic, troll leather helmet. Interesting. A new tier of armor? It says, a thick and sturdy hide. This is why trolls are so hard to kill. Interesting. Ah, uh, what else can we drop? Um, I'm sure I'll find more blueberries. Troll trophy collected. Very nice. Um, well, yeah, so now we have another reason to go back. We're out of inventory, and that means I was thinking about going in a straight line home. I, I wonder if that's a bad idea. I mean, it could be a bad idea. It might be a fine idea. I guess I'll find out as I try to travel the mountain. Oh, it's so mountainous. It's so many hills and mountains. This could be a so a bad idea. I don't know what that is. Oh, I'm freezing. Retreat! That's probably bad. Retreat! 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 Too cold! Okay. Feeling cold is fine. Freezing bad. Oh, never mind. It's... No, we have to go back anyways! I'm out of inventory. I, we can't. We got it. We got to head back to base, boys. Okay, so I have made it back home, and I want to see what exactly are we able to do here. So we do have some long-range goals. I probably should be working towards those. The long-range goal would be we want to build this thing right here. That would be the tanning rack, and the tanning rack. We have most of the stuff needed for it, but there's a few missing pieces. We need, we have the deer hide, that's fine. We're gonna need uh, more leather scraps, that comes from boars, and we need more flint. Uh, let's see, we've got, we need a lot of boar, my gosh. So maybe we, I was thinking about doing some upgrades, but you know what, I think it would be better if I just focus on, like, let's make sure that by up upgrading our gear, we're not, like, sabotaging our long-range progress. So I'm just gonna put all of this back in here, and we'll, we'll work on that stuff later on. Although, like, uh, what does it take to make the troll armor? Troll armor. Um, 
The troll tunic has an armor of six. Wow. Um, it also says it was warm. So does that mean it makes you more sneaky? That's crazy. This thing is a massive upgrade. Holy crap. Um, troll hide cape. Whoa, that one's like... So this seems like it's just better in every single direction. That's crazy. Uh, I don't know. I want to make the helmet first because, like, I bet the helmet is going to look awesome. And it does. it's not going to eat into any of the resources we would have been using. So let's go ahead and build the helmet. I want to see what the helmet looks like. Boom. Troll leather helmet. Here we go. Let's take the old helmet off. Wait, why am I looking over there? Look over here. Troll leather helmet, boys. Oh, that's you call that a helmet? It's just like, it's just a hood. It's not even a. What? What? Whatever. Now I'm gonna put my obsolete. I'm not gonna get rid of it. I'm gonna put it over here, and th this is like my armor locker. And that's because if I die and I need to go somewhere, you know, long and if I need to go somewhere that's far away and it's dangerous. Well, then, I, you know, I'm going to need, like, uh, a secondary suit of armor to help me recover the first suit of armor, basically. So there's no reason to just get rid of it. It also means that we know that we probably should be hunting trolls now that we know that we actually can take them out. Uh, I should probably build more arrows. Now, you know, it is using some of our equipment. Um, fire arrows. How much do you do? You do 11 damage and 22 fire damage. These do 22 damage. I wonder if fire arrows are better than... Let's just try these for now. So let me just build... I'll, let me build three. That'll give us a full stack of 100. There we go. I can, Flint is easy to get. I just need to go down the shore to grab it. So that's not a big deal. Let's throw these over here. And this is kind of like my rocks and woods pile. Okay, that's fine. Anyways, it's time to go back out. I'm going to see if I can sleep first to see if we can actually... Uh, get more daylight. Welcome back, boys! It is a new day, and uh, I believe the first thing, I want to go check out this area. Uh, this is the mountain area, so I'm probably going to cut through here, and then, I don't know, let's go up here afterwards. Now, it is possible that a crypt can appear in the meadow as well. Uh, from what I understand, it's not as common. But that doesn't mean that it can't, and it, it's an area, you know, there's nothing saying that we can't just, like, carve through this little path of, like, uh, unrevealed territory. Who knows what we're gonna find there? Maybe I'll find some pigs or something along the way. We do need 20 scraps of leather. We got, like, uh, four. So, I don't see the harm in it, and in fact, we're closing in on it right now. I thought it was going to be a little bit farther of a jog. Now, since I'm... Uh, the F button is how you activate Ekthir's power, and I'm just going to go ahead and activate it because it just lets you run more. It lets you run more and jump more, and that's perfectly fine with me because running and jumping means more efficiency in terms of stamina, and better stamina means we can cover ground more effectively. It also probably wouldn't be a bad idea to use it, and you can see it's only got a 20-minute cooldown, so we can just use it to cover ground more effectively, scout more effectively. We can use it. You can use it to train. Like, if you want to train sprinting, you want to train jumping, uh, you want to train swimming, this would be a great power to use. And I, I mean, it'd probably be even better if I used uh, stamina restoration items. Or a stamina restoration, f or stamina fa enhancing food. Because apparently there is a, uh, the system of food in fact, I can look at it right here. You see the fork is red. Red means that it focuses on health. Now, if the fork is green, then it means it focuses on stamina. Oh, look at this. We just found some food. Very nice. Gimme, gimme. Keep our supply of food going. Always need some more neck tails. Uh, let's go ahead and mark this location. We'll call this another just abandoned house. Ab I can spell abandoned house. Okay, I'm going to go north, and I'll see you there. And here we are at the edge. Man, we just found, like, a lot of stuff here. I'm going to mark this one as um, berry bush, berries, because there's just so many of them here. We can come back. Oh, I, I hear a lot of animals, too. I hear, I know there's boar here, but I also heard a... Let me just go ahead and pick all these berries. I don't see the arm in it. Here we go. Bam, 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 bam. Berries. 
Very nice. Okay, let's get these Pumbas. Oh, what are you doing here? Doesn't matter. I'll squish you just the same. Where is that deer at? Oh, there it is. Bingo! Okay, we got a little bit of this. I, I don't... Where did those boars go? I know they didn't just, like, walk away and disappear completely. Oh, no, there they are. I am never bored of boars. I mean, maybe I will be in the future, but right now I'm never bored of boars. Where'd the other one go? Huh. Whatever. That's not our main objective anyways. We are mainly looking to... We need to get into, like, the uncharted area. That is our goal. Oh my god, I'm finding all these other things along the way. Whatever. Let's just focus on our... Oh, nope, never mind. We gotta get the boar. Gimme. Okay, so we're just gonna go in this direction. I don't know what this... I don't know what, what is in store for us. But we're just gonna pick a direction and just go. At least that's what I'm planning. Looks like I gotta go over this river. That's fine, though. Shallow here. They keep taunting me with all these deer. Give me, get, let me get up. There we go, fine, thank you. Okay, I'm up, God. What is this? More deer? Not that I'm complaining, I'll take it. Big sneak attack! Boom! Let me see if the other one noticed. I don't think it did. Although I'm about to run out of st and let my stamina come back. Fortunately, it's not cold right now, so I'm, I'm guessing if I get a full suit of this um, troll armor, maybe I won't get cold anymore. And maybe the freezing area will just be cold. And the cold area might be normal, and then maybe the freezing area is just cold? I'm, maybe that's the way it works? I mean, it seems plausible. Oh, it's a gray dwarf. But just a gray ling. Now we know that you're actually a bunch of evil butt munchers, so I'm just gonna go ahead and smackinate you for great justice. What's this rune say? I bet it's a rerun. Yeah, it's a rerun. Okay, let's not go down there just yet. I did not think that the meadow would go this far north. I thought I was going to hit another section of the Black Forest, but apparently it's just not in the cards. I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i see you in a moment. I want to see how far this goes. All right, good news, boys. I have found another entrance, or I found rather the end of the meadow. Oh, to arms! Man, we're doing so much more damage with the spear due to, like, our skill-ups. Our skill- like, now I'm able- basically, if I do enough damage to them, it'll cause them- Oh, I think we just found another crypt. Awesome! Wait, get me, get me my smasher. Here we go. I don't think so. You met your end! What do we got over here? Okay, we've secured the crypt. Let's go ahead and mark it, because unfortunately we did happen to find the crypt way at the very end of the episode, so we'll mark that as a crypt. Let's go ahead and scout the general area real quick. Got a little bit of time left, maybe we'll find something good. Or maybe we'll find absolutely nothing, or maybe we'll find a troll, that would be good. Now that we know we can actually take him out. If you're wondering if there's a strategy to finding these crypts, I find the answer is no. I find the strategy is just start looking around. See, I don't even need to, like, block... I mean, I, I will still do it, but now I'm able to, like, stun them and get... Or I'm able to stagger them and get critical hits even without um, going for the blocks now because we do so much damage. Oh, there's something interesting. What's that? Got ourselves some kind of a fortification. Oh, they just popped in. We got ourselves a fight, boys.
Here comes the big game hunter. You didn't see it, you loser. Wait, let's try the, the torch on him. Yeah, aren't you like vulnerable to fire? Don't you fear the flame or something? Oh, actually, yeah, they are taking a like a surprising amount of damage from the fire. It's actually not bad. Yeah, not bad, actually. I mean, I don't want to use all my torch up. Come here. I'm going to stab you with my... There we go. With my pointy stick. Got him. Don't know what this is good for, but I'm grabbing it. Okay, let's investigate this ruined area over here might just be it might just be nothing i like that i'm getting a bunch of wood i'll be able to i'm actually going to incidentally be able to build things when i get back to base because there's still other things i want to build but i wanted to have some you know more action pa what, what? veg vizier the elder wow that's really far away why is why is the elder so far away in we go Hey, if you got any property in here, it's about to be mine. I'm just letting you know ahead of time. Why would you build a robot like this? Why would you ever do this? Now I don't. I, I don't. I can't even go up. Why would you build your place like this? What a stupid place. What, what's in the? Is the barrel like? Does the barrel have loot? What if I break it? I don't think the barrel had any loot, unfortunately. Okay, I think what we're gonna do is head back to the crypt. And oh, I can just push R to unequip. Uh, I'm just going to head back to the quick, the crypt, and we're just going to camp there because that's where we're going next, boys. We're going... Oh, did we check this area out? I can't remember if we looked inside to see if there's any loot. Let me take a look. Let me duck in real quick. Oh, yeah, it doesn't look like there's a darn thing here. Uh, oh, let's. Let, we're going to go to the crypt because we need certling cores. We need a lot of them. So we're going to have to go in here and get a whole bunch of them. Where is the crypt at? There it is. Right here. We are just going to go right here. And that's a crypt, right? I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, I'm even sheltered right here. Awesome. Okay, so I am going to... Let's get a screenshot in the, like, majestic look. Oh, this is kind of cool. Pretty cool looking place for a screenshot. So I think someone said control... Is it alt F10? I forget, there was a command to remove the interface. Get my face a little more in the sunlight. There we go. There's the screenshot, boys. The, uh, yeah, so we are going to be going into the crypt next. Hopefully this will get us some more certling cores. I'm hoping to get at least five so that we can build one of the two facilities. We'll probably make the, um... The charcoal kiln first, because I at least have wood to throw in the charcoal kiln. But um, we need 10 in order to make both the kiln and the forge. Anyways, let me know anything down in the comment section. Like the video if it was entertaining. Subscribe for future. Oh, got me attacked. Valheim content. Of course, remember, you want to be good to get good.